I'm not here to judge you, Ethan. I'm trying to save the life of your son. We still have time, but it's running out. Help me, Ethan. Tell me what you know. I'm sure you had your reasons for doing what you did. You didn't think you were doing any harm. You just wanted the pain to go away. I'll help explain all that to the judge. Don't let Sean die. Tell us what you know and we can still save him. Ethan, say something for God's sake! Look at these, Ethan. Look at these. Eight photographs. Eight lives taken. Drowned in the goddamn rain. Recognize this one, huh? That's your son, Ethan. That's Sean. He is still alive. Talk to me, Ethan. Say something! I kidnapped my son. But I can't remember what happened. I don't know where he is. The only way to find him is to let me out of here. I'm the only person who can save him. You don't remember anything, but you think you're the origami killer. I'm sorry, Ethan, but you're gonna have to do a lot better than that if you want me to believe you. I love my son. I love my son. If you keep me here, Sean is going to die. Time's running out, Ethan. And frankly, I don't care why you did it. The only thing I want to know is where you've hidden Sean. I don't know. I would already have saved him if I knew where he was. Okay. This is your last chance, Ethan. And this time, I suggest you think carefully before you answer. Where is Sean? I told you, I don't know. Ah! Wrong answer. Blake, what are you doing? This guy's a killer. He's got no fucking rights. He's gonna tell me everything. If you beat him, his confession's worthless. Now throw the case out. You fuck! Are you gonna tell me what I... Even if he is a killer, that doesn't give you the right to beat him. Whose side are you on, Norman? Are you defending this piece of shit? I'm defending the law. The law says he is innocent until proven guilty. This guy's got no rights, do you hear me? No rights at all! <laughs> 